Who is NBA's GOAT? The title is widely contested. Passionate fans nominate a whole list of contenders. However, the greatest of all time title belonging to Kobe or Michael Jordan seems to be the most widely accepted answer. This debate can get heated to say the least. Let's talk about the most recent explosive disagreement over this sensitive topic between two former NBA stars nonetheless. First, let's get you up to speed with John Sally's stance. Without a doubt, the majority of people would agree that Kobe Bryant was inferior to Michael Jordan. However, some people undoubtedly believe he is more skilled, with Sally standing out as one such person. He once stated that if Michael Jordan was tied, that would make Kobe tied plus. The guy should have been a poet. More recently, he told the press, a story of a time when sharing this opinion resulted in real-world circumstances. He went on to explain a partly comedic, partly somber story at the time. He got a nice punch in the eye from none other than Charles Oakley. Next, let's talk about the night of the infamous punch. Three things they say to never bring up in casual conversation, politics, religion, and the Kobe vs. Jordan debate. The former basketball player tells us of a night where he was sitting in a booth with his friends. One of the people with him was fellow NBA star Oakley. Someone around him brought up the forbidden question about who was better among the two giants. After some thought, he answered that Bryant was in fact the better player. This response was received with a swift punch to his arm, knocking the air out of the NBA star. His friend had delivered this hit fueled by his loyalty to Michael. Let's just say he made his point clear. Now let's talk about the talk show host's reaction. He said that the punch came out of nowhere and knocked all air out of me, and that he hit him so hard. He was in shock to say the least. However, Oakley's strictness and tough personality makes this incident less of a surprise. No further conflict arose out of this. Whew. But it was an act of passion that taught Sally a lesson to always check who is around to hear his controversial takes. Now onto some Lakers news. The Los Angeles Lakers may be holding out for a certain player that could be the reason why they have yet to complete a trade. According to a source, the franchise is allegedly waiting for a mystery player to make a move in order to use its two upcoming first round picks in 2027 and 2029. Let's get into it. Why the pressure is on the Lakers? Given that LA is 2-8 to start the season, it comes as a shock that the team has not yet made any strategic moves. They've got two high-value draft picks, which they might use to help LeBron James and Anthony Davis by acquiring some impact players. They must certainly use their two first-round picks wisely since they only have one opportunity to make a move that would put them in the running for the championship while LeBron James and Anthony Davis are still on the team. But who is it that the team is looking for? First of all, it was made clear that Ben Simmons and Kyrie Irving were not on the list, so we can discount them as options for our secret player. The team is willing to trade two future first-round picks for a superstar. According to the source, they want someone who will bring about a radical change. That means they're not after athletes like Terry Rozier, Eric Gordon, D'Angelo Russell, Gordon Hayward, and Gary Trent Jr. Don't get us wrong, these are brilliant players, but if the Lakers decide against sending picks for Miles Turner and Buddy Heald, they must also also decide against sending picks for those other athletes. The star they are after, is it Draymond Green? The Lakers have no need to send two future selections for a player who will be a free agent after the current season, so even though many supporters would like to see him wear the purple and gold jersey, this is not a realistic scenario. As a result, we're cutting him off the list too. Despite the possibility that DeMar DeRozan is involved, the Lakers would run the danger of losing him soon given his age. Let's get into who we think this mystery player could be and the potential trades that could take place. At number three, we have Zach Levine. Los Angeles Lakers receive Zach Levine. Chicago Bulls receive Russell Westbrook, 2027 first round pick, LAL, 2029 first round pick, LAL. Even though he signed a contract extension, Levine, the Chicago Bulls' current face, might still be traded by the franchise. The squad may look into a rebuild if their season long underwhelming start persists. The Bulls might wind up trading their stars in that rebuilding scenario scenario in exchange for draft picks, bottoming out to try to secure a good pick. The Bulls would have a cornerstone for their franchise if they selected either of this year's top draft prospects, Victor Wembayama or Scoot Henderson. Zach can't be moved right now because he agreed to a new deal with the Bulls this summer, but that could change later on in the season. The player would undoubtedly complement LeBron James and Anthony Davis in terms of play style. His three-level scoring in 
and accurate shooting would significantly boost the offensive of the club. In addition to LeBron, he'd give the Lakers another reliable option when it mattered most, simply because of his varied offensive repertoire and ability to play off ball. He would be a better match for the Lakers than Russell Westbrook. The possibility of having Zach and Anthony for the long future is one of the additional advantages of signing him for the Los Angeles Lakers. That would provide the team with a starting pair that they can rely on after their star player retires, and the two superstars would make a solid base for the team. Next at number two, we have Damian Lillard. Los Angeles Lakers received Damian Lillard, Portland Trailblazers received Russell Westbrook, 2027 first round pick LAL, 2029 first round pick LAL. He has a reputation for remaining loyal to the Portland Trailblazers despite his name being mentioned in trade speculations on a regular basis. Notably, he committed to the team for an extended period this past summer and is therefore not tradable. He fits the description of the mystery player the Los Angeles Lakers might be keeping an eye out for. James has always been a fan when it comes to him. And in 2018, Lillard made the noteworthy claim that he thought he could get along with the NBA legend. Both of them might be combined on the same club in this trade scenario, giving the Blazers player a real shot to finally contend for a title. He would be the ideal point guard to pair with James and Anthony in terms of play style. He can make his own shot, shoot well from a distance, and play effectively without the ball. This will help other players as there would be less offensive pressure throughout the regular season. The LA Lakers are one of the top defensive teams in the NBA overall, so even if his defense is an issue, they should be able to cover for him thanks to Davis, the defensive anchor. His trade to the Trailblazers might provide them the chance to try to tank for Victor Wembanyama or Scoot Henderson, but they may consider trading the superstar if they aren't in a position to compete by the trade deadline. He's a very cherished athlete in the community, therefore it goes without saying that witnessing Lillard win a championship would bring a lot of fans joy. I hope he gets the chance to achieve it. Finally, at number one, we have Kevin Durant. The Los Angeles Lakers get Kevin Durant, Brooklyn Nets receive Anthony Davis, the Lakers' 2027 first-round pick and the Lakers' 2029 first-round pick. Getting Durant for the LA Lakers is obviously not very viable right now, although the Brooklyn Nets have not yet made it clear that they are eager to resume negotiations for the superstar. They may do so if they fall short of expectations before the trade deadline. A deal involving Russell Westbrook and two pricey first-round picks is probably insufficient to acquire him. However, if they were to replace Westbrook with Davis, who remains one of the league's most adaptable big men, that might be enough to land KD. It's easy to see why the Lakers should trade for him. He's the player. He is the league's top mid-range shooter and a three-level scorer, and the team would undoubtedly have have a good chance of winning a title with those two superstars on the roster as he and James would instantly become one of the league's top collaborations. The goal of this trade for the Nets would be to acquire the player at a fair price. They would receive a player of all-star caliber and two picks that would probably be drawn in the lottery in 2027 and 2029. Although other teams will probably have strong offers for him, the Lakers' potential offer centered on Anthony and two first-round choices is unquestionably pretty alluring. They might run a risk by waiting for him to become available, but it is a gamble worth taking. Well, that's a wrap for this video, so Kobe Bryant or Michael Jordan, who do you think is the GOAT? Let us know in the comments below, and make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. We'll see you in the next one.